Trisha Paytas is going in the Celebrity Big Brother house. Let's discuss that. So if you are not aware of who Trisha is, I will link her YouTube channel down below. But just be aware, it's not for the young eye. It's something. I have mad respect for this woman. She has built a career out of literally nothing. And she's done this all by herself. So yeah, I am a Trisha fan. This video isn't about shading her. No tea, no shade. I love her to bits, but, and that is a big but. I am a little, little bit concerned about how she's going to handle the house. If you're not a fan of the show, it's one big mind game. <sighs> Trisha has dealt with some demons in her past and she has publicly talked about these demons on her YouTube channel. So she does not shy away from showing her feelings. I mean, she is probably going to be the perfect housemate for them. I don't think she will create drama, but I imagine she will be involved with some drama. Chaos just seems to surround her. And it worked well for her videos because it gives her views, but in the public eye this might not go down well, I don't know. It's going to be really weird to see her in Big Brother editing as they do edit things quite sneakily in their own way big brother do clickbait as well so yeah it's gonna be weird to not see her in her edited videos although most of her videos aren't that jump cutty they're pretty much free flow and she just talks she has got some stories the sun and the mirror are already all over the internet with She's going to spill tea on all the celebrities she slept with. I mean, I'm pretty sure she was a stripper at one point. So there's going to be some stories there. Pretty sure she lived in Vegas for a while. So I don't know. She's got a lot of stories. A lot of stories. So yes, Celebrity Big Brother UK are going to have a lot of fun with her. But I am 100% behind you, Trish. Please do not let me down. <laughs> But I'm so excited to tune in tonight. I believe it's 9 p.m. on channel 5. Just as I decide to film the video, the council decide to come cut the grass outside. Fabulous. I'll wait. Okay, so it's he's kind of moved down the street, but if you can still hear the lawnmower thing, I'm really sorry if that's annoying. <laughs> but I need to get this video done and uploaded because it is tonight. Big Brother is tonight. He's coming back up the road. Bro! But yeah, I wasn't even going to make a video this week. As you can see, if you did even notice, you probably didn't notice. I took last week off. I was going to take this week off as well. I'm just really not feeling the YouTube vibe right now. I can't afford to do all these DIYs. I know it sucks and I'm not being dramatic or soppy about it. I've just thought I'll fade out for a little bit and maybe just upload chatty videos like this on my Sundays. And I know today isn't a Sunday, but Big Brother's happening tonight, so I need to publicly announce all of this. But yeah, my life's going all right. Just thought I'd give you an update. Hopefully you all go and support Trisha. I mean, I don't know how she's going to survive without watching Game of Thrones. Like, I personally wouldn't be able to give up that part of my life to go in to something like Big Brother. Spoiler alert about Game of Thrones. Danny and John have met and I'm just waiting for them to fall in love and have their babies because they both have dragon blood already. They're both Targaryen. I mean, I think, aren't they like technically cousins or something? But there's a lot of incest in this show anyway, so yeah. So there's that. Although you do know Jon Snow's going to have to kill Danny at the end. You know that's going to happen, right? He did say it'll be a bittersweet ending. I think Jon is going to have to kill Danny, but it's going to be a sad one because he won't want to do it. 
I think she's gonna get some Mad King vibes and, you know, get a bit too, you know, all the power might actually go to her head. So yeah, I think John's, I mean, this show is, is John. It, everyone thinks it's Danny, but John is the main character in this show, literally. He is the son of blah, 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 Targaryen and bloody Linda Stark, Lynn Stark. Ned's sister, anyway. They're his parents, he's got a rule. <laughs> In other news, I'm slowly learning how to Twitter. I mean, does anyone actually understand Twitter? Because I don't. But if you want to follow me, I'll leave the link down below. And I'll also put it here. And it's a really good way to communicate with famous people. I've actually, yeah, had some responses oh yeah che cameron if you know who he is another youtuber he called me trash the other day but i did deserve it because i may have said i liked a logan paul vlog i mean yeah i had that coming i am trash i know i'm trash bro you got me you played me and uh yeah that's all over twitter now all his followers have seen that I'm trash. <laughs> what else is going on in my life? I don't know. Um, I'm painting my dog. Well, I'm not painting my dog. I'm painting a portrait of my dog on a quite a large canvas. And I was going to film it, but I just don't think you guys are interested in that sort of stuff. I don't know. I mean, I have some footage of it, just in case I felt like uploading next week. I don't know, let me know if you care, if you enjoy watching people speed paint. I really enjoy that, but that's just me. I don't think you guys would enjoy that. Dunno, let me know. Also, meet my cat. Hey, you my baby. She's so pretty. I mean, she always looks grumpy. Look how grumpy she looks. She's my grumpy Kit Kat. Her name is Kit Kat. If you ever watched Charmed, that was a good show. Their cat was called Kit Kat. So we named her after that. I am going away next weekend with my sister and niece. We're only going to the beach for a few days. But I was thinking of vlogging it, so that might be a thing, but yeah. My creative videos will be back soon. Sorry if there's loads of cat hair blowing in the, <laughs> in the video. Stay tuned for crappy videos filmed on my phone. Also, I'm one subscriber away from 400 subscribers. My goal this year was 500 subscribers. So if 101 people could come and support me, that would be insane. But it would also be cool if just one person subscribed because that means I'm nearly at my target. Very exciting stuff. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Don't know when it's going to be. And I still don't know how to say bye.